my god. Oh, but it does actually still smell. Today we are making our way to Pai from Chiang Mai on the notorious sick bus. The bus that everyone gets motion sickness. But we're going to put that to the test and we're going to take you along on the journey. So what we're doing now is just going to get some snacks then make our way to the arcade which is the bus station terminal 2. It costs us about 200 bahts of 5 pounds. We booked it on 12.goasia and uh, yeah it's a popular journey so we thought we'd take you guys along with us so you know what to do and you get to experience it yourself see if we see if we get sick or not ain't that right Tash? oh yeah I really hope not I hope no one else is sick on me <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Okay, let's see what snacks we can pick up then we'll order a grab while we're inside to avoid the taxi drivers wherever you are in asia grab and pick me and uber and apps like that are always cheaper than taking a taxi driver right what are we getting We made it to the bus station. I think this is going to be... Not that one, the one over there. Oh. But it's like this one. All right, it's like this bus here. So that's what's going to be taking us all the way to Pai, around those big bends. We've got our cheese toasties, so we're going to sit, eat these, and wait for our bus. So we're here at the bus stop. Um, just knocked down our cheese toasties, as you guys saw. So our bus leaves in about half an hour. I believe we have to put uh, our baggage on the roof. So I've got two bags. I separated it between my Patagonia bag, the big one, as you guys see, and the little black one with all the electronics and valuables like that. No way I'm putting that on the roof. Pretty nice bus stop, to be honest. It's nice, simple. Um, just go up to the lady. She tells you where to go. And now we're just waiting. We should leave on time and it should be nice and easy. Nice smooth journey until uh, someone pukes on you or whether I feel sick myself. Fingers crossed we don't. We haven't got any motion sickness tablets, anything like that. They do recommend you bring some though, um, but we're not gonna, we're just gonna risk it. Tash, they yeah. sent us on the tourist bus. Yeah. We are on the tourist bus. The other bus it was all locals and this one is all tourist travellers. Yeah. That's cool. We're a we're a team. That one there, yeah. Perfect. Thank you. Oh wow, time to leave. Chiang Mai. It was nice seeing you. We'll be back probably for one more day somewhere along the line. We gotta come back from Pai. What seat number are we on? We're on seat number 5D, 5A. We go here, yeah? Yes. Oh, lovely. Oh, it's a lot better than that bus in Sri Lanka. It was like a very good It's nice, it's better than that air you had flying. Isn't it? Well, we don't get free snacks and drinks. Yeah, no free snacks, no free drinks, no free food. A good leg. Oh, yeah, a good leg room. Was he hurt? No. No, all good. Older gentleman, though. Like, really old. Oh, really, yeah? <laughs> How long was you waiting for? About an hour and ten minutes. Yeah. There was two buses, but there wasn't enough room. <coughs> so. Fair enough, fair enough. Uh, I've got a fresh bottle of water here if you want it. Are you sure, yeah? Oh, no worries.
F762 on the way from Chiang Mai to Pai. Toilet break. Okay. Toilet and shop, 10 minutes. Stretch your old legs. Okay, so 10 minute bus break. You stretch your legs, go to the toilet, get a drink, get some snacks. There is a lot of curves. So if you do get motion sickness, definitely you're gonna feel it here, 100%. Um, but if you don't, it's okay. You can see out the windows everywhere. It's quite a good journey. You've got good leg room. Um, the bus in Sri Lanka was way worse, man. Way worse. That was six hours of... We got there, so it was good, it was cheap. But it was six hours of being uncomfortable. For sure. Anyway, let's go uh, go to the toilet, have a look around the shop, and see what we can find. Yeah, let's try that too. So the toilet costs three baht each, which is uh, is standard here in Thailand, anyway. Fine. Thank you. So here's the toilet situation. Nice, simple, basic. In the other ones, there's hornets everywhere. Um, but... Anyway, let's get out of here. Whoa. That's a quick 10 minutes here. We picked up a... <laughs> oh, bless you. We picked up a Diet Coke, 20, um, 20 bar. Now it's time to get back in the minivan. Woo! That was a good little break huh? about an hour and a half left. It's not too bad, guys. Easy. It's nice to stretch the legs. Okay, no, Tash, how you feel? I feel medium. Uh, cheers, man. That's it. Oh, we're good, sir. Okay. Oh. okay, we made it to Pai. Cool. Every place we go to is more like a booth. Anyway, I think we got like a 10 minute. So, how much for one day? Uh, 150 and start. 150? Yes, yeah? Okay. We're just gonna walk to our um, accommodation and then maybe come back. Okay. And the big one is more than that. It's about 150. Yeah? Okay. Cheers, man. Thank you. So, like 150 for one day rent a motorbike. Not bad, man. We need to find the bamboo bridge. We're going to drop our bags off and then we'll probably come back to 7 Eleven in a minute and yeah. uh, jump back in. Yeah. But to be honest, I can't be asked to carry around my bags anymore, man. Yeah, I need to walk off this sick feeling. Wait, you sick? Yeah, I do feel sick. Yeah, this never was actually sick, but I feel it. You know, and it just needs to wear off. Yeah. But I suppose I think I need to eat something. Yeah. Of course, a nice vibe here. It's definitely more of a hippie vibe. But really, really nice. Authentic Thai food. Over the bamboo bridge. Okay, we found the bamboo bridge. We got to walk over the bamboo bridge, and then our hotel should be about two minute walk from there. Yeah, I'm kind of liking the vibe of Pai. Maybe we stay here for another couple of days. Um, also, renting a bike-wise, we're a little bit cautious after we got pulled over by the police in Vietnam. Um, but look at this bamboo bridge, one sec. Wow. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> huh? I reckon you go, then I go. Yeah? I don't know if we should both be on this. You think? You gotta watch every step you take over the bamboo bridge. You don't wanna fall into that flowing river. <laughs> yeah, the guys. I don't know. Yeah. Hey, man. You're not gonna fall you're not gonna fall in. You'll be fine. I was all ready to take it slow <laughs> and then I got 
Okay, let's find our accommodation. It's in like a hut somewhere. Um, it might be down the road. Hey. Gotta make our way down this dirt track road. This is gonna be a bit ominous at night, a bit scary. Luckily, there ain't too many like, wild animals and dogs and things that we've seen anyway. There we stand over there. Just feels so relaxed here. To be honest, it feels really, really nice. If there's good internet connection here and we can edit, all good. I'm really excited about that hammock. Yeah. I would love to take a nap on that. Yeah. I think that's going to be on here. Hello. Hello. Hi, it's nice here. <laughs> wow. Get my passport out. Let me check the passport. On the end. Cool. This key for your room. Oh, thank you. Thank you very and much. this, uh, sorry. Oh. And this password Wi-Fi yeah. mm -hmm. uh, for your room and P6. <laughs> I reserved this or two for this room. Okay, yeah. And this password and this is my phone number. Okay, oh, perfect. If you have any problem, you can call me anytime. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. Lovely. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. We have a lovely balcony area here. Um, we've got a little sitting area. My favourite thing, which is the balcony. Give it a go. Um, the hammock. Do you want me to get in? Yeah. Oh. oh my god. Oh wow, that is so comfy. And then you come in, we have our door here, inside, little mat. We have two fans, which is really nice. So, two fans, we can angle them facing at us, yeah, which will be good yeah. for sleep. Nice window here, so we can see this nice view here. Cute little hairdryer I've ever seen. Oh, nice. And no. lights. And then, and then your classic toilet. little um, Asian washroom, toilet yeah. kind of room. But it's kind of nice, it's not a shower curtain. I kind of like the fact that it's just like a wall thing. So you haven't got a shower curtain touching you. That's kind of nice. And breakfast is included as well. Breakfast is from 7 o'clock in the morning till 10 o'clock. So we're definitely going to show you guys the breakfast as well. So the price of this, I think I said it earlier in the vlog, but I believe it comes to £14.50 British pounds, um, which is un unreal. That's for both me and Tash, this room and breakfast included. Now tell me that isn't a bargain. So how did you find that bus journey, Tash? <sighs> Genuinely, it was okay. Like the fact that we were in a nice bus, we had plenty of room, there was air con, like in that way I cannot complain at all, but I just, I genuinely didn't think that all the turns would make me sick because I've never been motion sickness in, I've never had that in my life. So the fact that I did start feeling a little bit, little bit sick well, did surprise me. There was actually one term, Brad, that I decided to try and distract myself by playing that game where you have to make 10 out of like four numbers. There was four numbers upon like the side of the, um, taxi thing and I was doing it and then as I was doing it I started feeling really weird and then we went down we were going downhill we had like a really tight turn like a literal hairpin turn and all of a sudden I sort of looked out the window and I was like oh my god I had like a wave come over me and I was like oh my god I actually might be sick but luckily we were really close by then so it was all right but if you get travel sick and you know you do then definitely take travel sickness tablets if you've never been travel sick in your life don't think you're safe because <laughs> I was nearly a goner. <laughs> We're going to do a quick speed test check to check the Wi-Fi because sometimes you go into a paradise like this and you don't know the Wi-Fi speeds and sometimes you're disconnected but if you want to do some work Wi-Fi is definitely important especially this day and age. Are we going to go on speed test? Let's give it a go. So seven Seven megabits a second, six megabits a second. It's not the best. It's not the best Wi-Fi, definitely. Well, it's going up now. So 8.72 download megabits a second. So definitely it's not the best, but it'll get you by. You can still watch your YouTube. You can still upload and download stuff. It's just gonna take a little bit longer. In Bangkok, you're getting speeds of 200. Here, you're getting 8.72. Cool, ain't this the life? 
Wow. Beautiful views. A nice relaxing hammock. And all for cheap. Can't go wrong, baby. Hi from the future. So we've just finished off in Pi. So make sure you go and watch that video. However, you'll see my bag is here hanging up. That is because we rode the sick bus back from Pi to Chiang Mai and it definitely lived up to its name. There was a gentleman who was sick all over the back of the bus, very bad. They had to clean it up and everything. And a lot of it ended up on my rucksack because my rucksack was at the bottom of the pile of bags. Give it a sniff, Tash. <sighs> Oh, no, but, no, but it does actually still smell. <laughs>